Hi. You're Francis? Yep. Nice to meet you. Lauren C. Williams? Uh, no, I'm Renee Simkovs. Uh, uh, Lauren is the potential uh, summer intern. Oh, Do you know how Krista normally sets up the video for? No. Okay, because last time we had it on here, but I can't seem to get it to work. Yeah. It seemed so easy last month. Maybe that'll be okay. Is it still raining outside? Mm -hmm. Like thinking about just doing something, not really. Oh, okay. Hi. Hi. Anybody else coming? Uh, John on his way. John said he would be 15 minutes late. And no one has seemed to join the Zoom meeting yet. I guess you sit up here. I don't know. I couldn't figure out how to get the video thing that Krista had on top of here last time. So I think up here. I'm nice. sorry, I can't. Uh, I couldn't figure out how to get the video webcam thing on here that Krista had last time. So I think sitting up here is best, at least for this month. Francis? Yes? You and I have a job to do. Which is? We're supposed to go to the museum and go find those files. They're there? Yeah. yeah. Right. And also, uh, 
Yeah. Look at the rest of the quick collections downstairs. Yeah. Have it, have I it saw that. Oh, okay. Well, you said give me a day and a time, and I'll. No, no, whatever I'm going. You want to do something? I'm free just about every day. Well, tomorrow's bad, but I could do Thursday and Friday. Okay, I'll, I'll, I'll email you. Okay. Uh, yeah. right. uh, at least somebody knows how to turn the lights on. Well, let's look around for a the light switch. Oh, right? switch, right? I've been a mushroom so long, I don't pay attention. How are you doing? I'm doing okay, my class is fogged up. Man. Me too. I can't. I can't stand these things anymore. Mess. Put some fog up on them. The glasses. When they warm up, I think I'll be all right. Yeah. Oh, I had no idea on this. Marsha Caro is the business administrator of the borough of Middlesex. Oh, look at that. Marsha Caro has a new job. Okay. Well, she, she was the clerk somewhere. Clerk there. This is the annual report. Yeah, I guess. Well, this has been left up there, so I guess I can take it. Interesting. Board of Commissioners. See if I know anybody since I used to live in Middlesex. Oh, come on, Paul Tomasco is still there. So everybody else is going to be zoomed in, I guess. Yeah, but no one's joined yet. Mm -hmm. But I guess there's two minutes. And, and the, the person who's getting interviewed, are they coming in or are they going to? Uh, I don't think so. Zooming? Um, I don't think they're coming in. I think, I think that's why we should still look at the resume. Okay. Beggars can't be choosers. Well, everybody was supposed to respond to you. So they were going to be here or there. Mm -hmm. Oh, I see Chris is on. Yeah. Yo. Yo, yo. Hi. What's up, guys? Nothing much. It's all me. We're we waiting for a quorum. Is that what's going on? Uh, let's see. We might even have a quorum. Just three of us. Texas, we're waiting for Paul Egg. Right. All right. So, Renee, the girl who sent the resume, then she's not going to be on at all? Or? I don't think so. Okay. It, was Alexis going to talk about it? or? Uh, I think so. Yeah. Okay. How many is a quorum? Three is a quorum. Three is a quorum. We're a quorum. We're a quorum team. Well, let me give it a, yeah, or... a couple more minutes. Okay. See if anybody else has on.
if they're having trouble with the Zoom getting on. I can try uh, sending the invite out again. Because yeah, was this planning board, they were having trouble with the Zoom. They said people can't hear and all that other stuff. Because when any of the other people said they were going to be in attendance, right? Um, I think Will was the only one to actually respond. Okay. Um, so I don't know for certain, but they didn't say that they weren't coming. Okay. I guess I'll give one more to start. I guess we'll get started. May you want to mm -hmm. call the meeting to order? Okay. I call the Historic Preservation Committee meeting to order at 7.36 p.m. In compliance with the Open, uh, Open Public Meetings Act, this is a regularly scheduled meeting pursuant to the annual meeting notice published in the January 28, uh, 2021 issue of the Hunterdon County Democrat. A copy of the agenda was forwarded to the Hunterdon County Democrat filed in the township clerk's office posted on the bulletin board and township website on March 12, 2021. Okay, take, a, take attendance. Uh, Alexis Antricoli, Francis Gavigan. Present. Will Harrison. Here. Chris Sobieski. Present. Paul Sturchell. Margaret Sullivan. John Saramba. Present. Okay. Okay, uh, Pledge of Allegiance. Like, pledge allegiance to, to the, the flag of the United States, States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. All right. Well, seeing no, no, no citizen will review the agenda. Any Additional items? I don't believe there is any, right, Renee? Nope. Okay. Citizens privilege, any citizens out there? I'm not even going to ask for an opening <laughs> or a closing. I move it, recognizing there are no public business. Okay. I'll That's, second that. All in favor? Aye. Aye. Okay. okay. Uh, presentation of the minutes. Any, should I have a chance to read the minutes and any comments or corrections that you need to see fit? I move your approval. I abstain. I wasn't here. I abstain. I wasn't here either. So we table that the next meeting, I guess. Okay. Okay. Because we don't have enough people to vote to approve it. Um, okay. Unfinished business. East Animal Historical Society. Uh, nothing new, other than it was a couple months ago after we've had our last. Meeting. I think there should be uh, a board meeting coming up in the next few weeks. Uh, I think the timing of when the country opens is sort of when the museum would open. Mm -hmm. um, there has been some discussion of programs and things like that, but it's a little challenging. Um, there's not really much to say. All right. Same thing with the East Amway. Museum. Uh, and again, sorry for missing last month's meeting. I just couldn't get out of the office until about midnight that night. So, um, West, uh, anything on the West Amwell anniversary? You hear anything um, else? Me. 
they were more, I think, trying to figure out if East Amel was going to do anything. And then if East Amel was, then they were going to collaborate together. But there didn't seem to be. Well, I think we should have them invite them. Uh, when's the anniversary date? Do you remember? I don't remember. Do you remember well? No. Okay. Maybe we should find that out and invite them to the next meeting or represent them to the next meeting and see if we should collaborate with them. Discuss things with them at that point. Chris, you don't know anything about it, do you? Uh, nothing beyond last meeting. Not really, no. I know, I, I think, if I recall, we were trying to figure out the date. We didn't really know the precise date. I mean, the year, I think, we were, you know, it was obviously, you know, understood. But, uh, yeah, no, nothing beyond that, really. Okay. Well, I think we should just invite some, somebody to the next meeting and discuss it and see if we're going to go ahead with it. Yeah. Right, new business, uh, Marilyn Cummings and the historic bridge certification. Uh, I have not talked to her. Um, there is, I do know that that bridge is on the books to be repaired this spring by the county. I know that from the commissioners directly. Mm -hmm. So it will get hopefully fixed correctly. And all of that, the last I talked to Marilyn, she was trying to put together something to send off to SHPO and things like that. I just wasn't able to do a lot of things in the last month. So I'm sure it's a my bad, but. Right. Well, maybe just reach out there for the next meeting. So sure. maybe to come in and give, her, give us an update if she wants. Okay, so we did get a resume for the quick collection intern. I guess I thought Alexis was going to probably be on and discussing that with us. But um, Renee, have you, did you hear anything from her eye? What what the suggestions were? Nothing. Yeah, I I know as much as you do with the resume. Okay, so I think we're going to have to table that the next time. I mean, I looked at it. Sorry, I'm late here. There she is. Okay, hey Alexis. Thanks. Right, on. that was timing. We were just talking about the resume. Okay. All right. So go ahead. Um, uh, is this a person you're recommending that we should hire? Yeah, that's the student that I spoke with who I would recommend. She's willing to do it for credit, um, an unpaid for credit internship. Um, she has a lot of relevant experience and experience with past perfect. So I think more than most, um, graduate students, she'd be able to, uh, transition into actually doing the work pretty quickly. Her resume is very impressive. Well, I thought, I mean, if she's available and willing to work with us, I would say, uh, by all means, approve. Uh, we'd like to meet her, of course. Uh, is is there any way we can meet her next meeting, Alexis? Or you know, because I mean, sure. I, think, I think we definitely want to do it with her and see what her schedule is and when when she wants to do it. I guess it's going to be over the summertime, I would think. Uh, yeah. So um, it would be over the summertime. I think that's when she would have availability. Um, so I'd be happy to invite her or to work with um, Krista to get her invited to the next uh, meeting uh, okay. to talk to all of you. And like I said, I'm still happy to supervise the project and help her out. And Alexis, you're going to coordinate with Renee, our new secretary. So, uh, OK. OK, I will coordinate with Renee. <laughs> We all, yeah, we got to get used to that. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> uh, just I'll work on it. <laughs> uh, hold on one second. Will wants to say. Now that we have a quorum, can we revisit the minutes? Yes. Yes, we can. Um, well, we're going to, uh, Alexis, we want to go back into the minutes and there's a quorum. Sure. Uh, so I, I, if you, there's a move to approve the minutes. I made a motion, Alexis, to approve the minutes, but we need a quorum to approve them. So that's you. Okay, I second. Okay. Well, who was here in uh, favor? Uh, 
Okay. Okay. All right. Perfect. All right. Approved. Thanks, Paul. <laughs> <laughs> That's why you have to have the co chairs up here. So, all right. Perfect. Um, all right. The, so, then, court collection intern, I mean, we want to meet her first before approving, I guess. Correct. It'd be, be great. Good. Yeah. So, yeah. So, get her here in the next meeting so I can approve her and get her started. Sure, I will invite her to the next meeting and then we can work with her um, on scheduling stuff. Okay, a protocol question. Besides our approval, would we need the approval of the township committee to bring her on, on board? I don't know. I'm going Chris, to know did you hear that? Hey, Chris? Yeah, no, I overheard. Yeah, I, if I remember correctly, Krista said at her last meeting, should we kind of just be treated the same way as any volunteer would. So I don't think, it, you know, it'd just be the simple, like, you know, she fills out the little, uh, you know, little questionnaire. And I, I guess she'd probably have to come before township committee too. If, uh, you know, the rest of the members want that to happen. I mean, you know, I'm, I'm totally fine with it personally. So I don't uh, see the so need. Then, to do that. So then, I mean, your committee meetings before ours, and I don't want to push it off to May. Yeah. So if, if you can coordinate that and get her to the, and I'll show up at the township. Will Will and I will show up to the township committee meeting next time. Okay. Okay. Um, so we should have her come. And do I understand she'll come to the township committee meeting? Or, yeah, because because well, Alex, likely, yeah. Have, have a township committee has to approve her because she's a volunteer. Okay. Just, just because of the township insurance regulations. And Got all. it. Yeah. So yes. Yeah, no, so that makes sense. So let, we'll invite her there, but we're also going to invite her here uh, uh, for both meetings in April. Okay, but the township will do the official approval. Yeah, I think that's yeah. Yeah, idea. they would probably so. need to. Where is the computer with the past perfect software located? Is it in the it's museum in the in the basement somewhere in this building? It's in the museum in the office. In which case she would need to have an access code to get into the museum. Yeah, but let's get her approved. All right. And then I won't get, then I, won't get there. Yeah, I agree. Yeah, I mean, and if, yeah. I just want to say if that's, I'm happy to be as a security thing because I'm on the Historic Preservation Committee, if it makes sense for me to be there while she's there and to have, well, maybe her, that's yeah. fine with me. One other. Well, any, any one of us. Uh, could, but either either here. Will and I will be with you because we don't want to have a quorum at the meeting, you, you, at the township meeting. Because that'd be a violation of Robert's rules. So you'll go and it either Will or I'll go with you at the township meeting next time. Well, I almost always go to the township committee meeting, so you may be off the hook, Will. Well, only two of us right. can meet anywhere. Right. Without violating, you heard me on this a long time ago that I think three is an unworkable quorum, but that's what we, we, we got, right? You know, we, we've asked the township committee to revise that. Yeah, well, we'll talk, we'll talk to Chris about that again about revising. So. Okay, so I, so I should let her know when the next township committee meeting is and the next historic preservation meeting. Yeah, it's the second Thursday in April, whatever that. Davis. Okay, I'll coordinate with Renee. Uh, I think next month it's the 17th. 17th? Okay. Will someone get her resume to the township? Yeah, for township committees on the 8th and then uh, historics on the 20th. The 20th. Right. Okay, and then we'll work on the details after that? Yes. Okay, yeah. great. All right, so you'll be there and then one of us will be there. Well, Francis is there, and then she's then it's fine. Yeah, we'll just coordinate with between the three of us beforehand, just to make sure one of us is there. It's going to be probably Francis. Though. It's almost always Francis, right? Uh, <laughs> <Chris>. <laughs> okay, that's fine. Then feel free to be there, Mr. Chair. Yeah. Well, well, like I said, I don't want to have a quorum. Lexus is going to be there. You're going to be there. I don't want to have any issues. So. I think that's something we have to really abide by. I, I think that's like one of the exceptions. Like you guys can 
it's not that you can't like all be together. It's like you can't all be together and doing business uh, without well, noticing it. You know what I mean? I, I, at least that's how I understand it. I could be wrong, but that's okay. You know, uh, well, well, the th well, three of us up here, Chris, we'll figure it out. Yeah, yeah. Because as I think about it, like if you all just like show up at like you know at mom's or something on on a Saturday, by coincidence, like yeah. you, you know. Yeah. And then again, who knows? It's New Jersey. There's a lot of weird stuff that goes on here. So. Yeah, you think? <laughs> so. Understatement of the year, right? Yeah, no. All right, so that's great. Thanks, Alexis, for this. This is going to be good. Yeah, so finally, maybe the good, like Will has been saying, what, 10 years, Will? The quick collection will be finally done. Supposedly 15. Be, I don't know what how we could find done, but right. Right. it done. sounds good. Yes. Um, uh, one thing, I, since we're on a quick collection, I just want to bring up a thing that, Chris, and maybe you can find this out for us. There was, uh, back in 2008, there was 100 acid-free boxes that were bought to store the historical, and for some reason, no one can find them. What were they? Acid-free boxes? Acid-free boxes to store historical documents and, and, and historical things, so you know, it doesn't deteriorate over time. And it was done in 2008. Yeah, yeah. But nobody knows where they are. Well, I'm sure there's a, some of them down in our in our room downstairs. So over at this here? Yeah. Oh, okay. And, and some of them may have already been transported to the museum. Okay. There are both folders and boxes at the museum. I know that. All right. Well, if for next meeting, somebody can check it out and just give me an inventory of it that way we know everything's okay right because we're going to use them yeah I'll, I'll, I'll see if Kristen knows where they're at they're probably in the basement okay hopefully unless somebody stole them all right well thank you all right items for discussion any other items for discussion all right all right Chris give us a township committee report uh, not a whole lot to report on, <laughs> at least as far as historic goes. A lot of other stuff, mm -hmm. but um, yeah, nothing really super big going on pertaining to this. Okay. Uh, farmland and open space. Okay. I think that was Paul, but was he's Paul. not here. Okay. Table that the next time. We have no vouchers to present. We have no public to open to. We have no correspondence. And I guess I'm going to ask for a motion to adjourn. So moved. Second. All in favor? Aye. Aye. Dang, that was quick. Well, 20, that's probably the fastest meeting I've ever participated in in the past oh. three years of being in Township, dude. Well, I mean, it's. I'm not complaining. No, no, no. I mean, we're going to get going on this stuff. I am. Going this is good. Francis and I have to find the, those documents that were Barbara's that, that I believe were in the museum. Francis and I were assigned, yeah, yeah. and we I just talked we just talked earlier, and uh, we will have something to report next meeting. Right. right. And at the same time, we will check and see what's going on in the basement in terms of what we need need to move to the museum and maybe you can handle on how many of the acid free boxes we can identify. Okay. I think they're the, 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 the beige colored ones. Yeah, they're sort of yeah. I know. not the yeah, well, first box type. No, they're sort of short. Well well like Chris and I said, you know, we would use our trucks, right, Chris? Take the stuff over. You know. Oh we gotta make Your sure truck that is my boat. Yeah. Stuff. Yep, you got it. I hope Francis and I will be able to report some information that will help us. Okay. Yeah, my only limitation is the so, stairs. Yeah. Can I ask a question about the township meeting? Does she have to go in person? I'm just reading the... Um. Yeah, I, I think we're moving back. We're, I think, yeah, no, we are exclusively uh, in person. Um. It, let me talk to Chris. So there might be a way for her to just zoom in. Uh, does she live kind of far away? I don't want to have to make her drive to. Um, she lives in New Brunswick. 
Yeah, that's that's too long of a drive. Well, I'll see what if we can swing something. Okay, thanks, Chris. I appreciate that. I mean, if she was local, I wouldn't worry about it. But yeah, yeah I guess no, I'm reopening. I, I don't want to make her come out here. <laughs> yeah, I know this is all the right. Okay. <laughs> okay. Thank you. All right. All right, any? All right. I wonder where they are. Our other members did not report to you, uh, Renee. No, you were the only one that responded. You're going to have to be a little more aggressive. <laughs> Yeah. We should get the vice chair to be aggressive. Uh -oh. <laughs> Sounded like a volunteer to me. Passing the buck, buck around back here, doesn't it? Yeah, I think it went around and hit you this way. <laughs> Even though you're sitting. <laughs> yeah, yeah. All right, great. All right. All right, guys. Thanks. Have a good night. Good Take night. Care. Good Later. night. Yeah, that'll be good. Oh, I, I mean, her resume was